Germany is ushering in a new era of transportation with the debut of its sleek, whisper-quiet, high-speed train. Germany's new high-speed train is a smart, eco-friendly innovation that replaces outdated systems by cutting emissions and connecting major cities more efficiently. As nations worldwide seek climate solutions, Germany's rail initiative stands out as a guiding light. On today's great train speed, we uncover the story behind this breakthrough and its impact on how we travel. Germany has entered a new era of rail travel with the premiere of the ECEL, Deutsche Bahn's newest generation of intercity express trains and the first to offer step-free boarding across all doors. The unveiling at Berlin Ostbahnhof was more than a press event. It symbolized a cultural and technological milestone for Europe's busiest railway network. The train's low floor design eliminates the gap between the platform and the door, allowing wheelchairs, strollers, and luggage to roll directly onto the car. It's a subtle but transformative shift, making travel truly barrier free. For a country that moves millions daily, inclusivity is now built into the hardware, not added as an afterthought. Inside, the ICEL reveals an entirely redesigned interior palette, warm wood textures, soft gray fabrics, and adaptive lighting that changes hue throughout the day, turn the car into a dynamic environment rather than a static compartment. Over 1,600 passengers participated in testing 562 newly developed seats, each featuring integrated outlets, folding tables, and tablet holders. The result is ergonomic yet simple bringing a space that feels simultaneously familiar and futuristic. Deutsche Bahn's engineers also solved one of high-speed rail's persistent frustrations called poor phone reception. Signal permeable windows now let cellular signals pass through without interference, eliminating the need for repeaters and ensuring clear connections throughout the trip. Above every seat, small LED indicators glow red, green, or white to show occupancy in real time. The details may seem small, but together they redefine the rhythm of travel with less guesswork. Accessibility extends to the very layout. Wider doors and aisles ensure wheelchair users can navigate without assistance. Height-adjustable tables in dedicated mobility spaces adapt to personal needs. Meanwhile, families find an entirely new travel experience, including Deutsche Bahn's largest family section ever created, with 46 seats and a separate toddler zone of nine miniature seats, playful decor, and stroller space. It's not merely a nod to parents, but it's also an investment in the next generation of rail passengers. All of these changes signal Deutsche Bahn's effort to move beyond speed as a selling point. More than a fast train, the ICEL is designed around human comfort and accessibility. It treats comfort and inclusion as performance metrics in their own right. In doing so, it transforms Germany's high-speed network into something more than infrastructure a public space where design, empathy, and engineering coexist. We've just seen how the ICEL reshapes comfort and inclusion from the ground up, but the story doesn't end there. Where will this next generation train actually go? Let's follow its first routes and see how far this people-focused design can reach. All that's coming up next, so if you're enjoying this journey, don't forget to subscribe for more updates like this. The ICEL will enter service gradually, starting the 14th of December 2025, with daily routes between Berlin and Cologne, two economic anchors of the nation. This debut corridor is symbolic. It links the federal capital with the industrial heart of North Rhine-Westphalia, showcasing Deutsche Bahn's reliability under heavy demand. From 1st May 2026, the train's reach expands northward to Hamburg and Westerlin the beloved North Sea Resort. By 11th July 2026, the network will stretch even further with new vacation routes from Frankfurt and Maine and from Cologne via Münster to Silt will bring low floor comfort to Germany's summer travelers. Another branch from Dortmund to Oberstdorf in the Bavarian Alps will serve winter tourists, blending high-speed rail with scenic regional access. The project also exemplifies international collaboration. 
The train is built by Talgo, whose expertise in articulated lightweight design allows for smoother curves and reduced energy consumption. Talgo's modular construction enables maintenance of shorter, flexible train sets that can easily be lengthened or coupled, providing DB with unprecedented operational agility. Once domestic deployment stabilizes, Deutsche Bahn plans to take the train beyond national borders. Routes to Amsterdam, Copenhagen, and Vienna are already in preparation, pending safety certification and mutual interoperability standards. These links will strengthen Europe's north, south, and east-west corridors, creating an alternative to short-haul flights and extending the environmental benefits of electrified travel across frontiers. A passenger could one day board in Hamburg and disembark in Copenhagen without a single step or border interruption. So, with new routes stretching across Germany and soon beyond its borders, the ICEL is already reshaping how people move. But can it also change how we think about mobility itself? Drop one, if you believe the future of rail depends on technology and sustainability. Or zero, if you think speed still matters most. The ICEL represents more than design elegance. It's a manifesto for sustainable mobility. Constructed primarily from lightweight aluminum, it reduces mass and thus energy consumption by roughly 20% compared with previous ICE generations. Regenerative braking systems return power to the grid and LED lighting cuts interior electricity use in half. Together, these innovations move DB closer to its pledge of achieving climate neutrality by 2040. Each new train helps replace older, less efficient rolling stock, saving thousands of tons of carbon emissions annually. Environmental sustainability merges with social sustainability. A truly green system must also be equitable, ensuring everyone can participate in the mobility transition. The ICEL achieves this by design. The elderly, parents, wheelchair users, or anyone with limited mobility can now travel with dignity and independence. As Europe's demographics age, that inclusivity becomes an essential part of long-term resilience. Accessibility is not a cost, it's a capacity. Inside, the atmosphere feels intentionally human. Adaptive lighting shifts from crisp daylight to warm evening tones, mimicking the natural circadian rhythm. Enhanced insulation and smooth running bogies cut cabin noise dramatically, creating what passengers describe as a floating silence. For business travelers, continuous mobile signal and onboard Wi-Fi transform the train into a moving workspace. For families, the expanded play zones and stroller spaces turn journeys into shared experiences rather than endurance tests. Every aspect of the ICEL, from tactile door buttons to clearer signage, shows an understanding that comfort and clarity define modern luxury better than gold trim or excessive speed. Technological intelligence complements physical comfort, the reservation system uses LED seat status displays synchronized with Deutsche Bahn's mobile app so passengers can check availability before boarding or mid-journey. Onboard diagnostics continuously monitor temperature doors and traction systems, allowing real-time adjustments and predictive maintenance. This digital ensures reliability and is a crucial factor for Deutsche Bahn as it works to improve punctuality across its long-distance network. Looking beyond 2026, Deutsche Bahn foresees the ICEL as a model for Europe's next generation of inclusive high-speed rail. If adopted by neighboring networks, its low-floor concept could make cross-border journeys entirely step-free. The integration of energy efficiency, accessibility, and digital service sets a benchmark others are likely to follow. When that service to Cologne departs in December 2025, it will carry the weight of expectation and the promise of renewal. Germany's railways have long embodied precision and progress. Now they also embody inclusion and care. The ICEL proves that the future of travel is not defined solely by how fast we move, but by how smoothly we connect with our environment, our communities, and each other. Germany's new high-speed train is here, and it is built for everyone, built for tomorrow. And that's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, stay safe, train well, and keep an eye out for good rail news.